So these are the five Tibetans. The optimum level to practice is 21 times, but you can build up. So if you can't manage all 21, then I wouldn't advise attempting all 21 to start with. Perhaps do a little bit in the morning and then complete it in the evening or another part of the day. Okay, they're called rites as opposed to exercises. There are five. Between each one, we will take two breaths in through the nose and out through pursed lips, okay? So you'll need a mat for the rites that are practiced laying down. To start with, you'll be standing and spinning. So let's stand. Standing in Tadasan, feet uh, hip width apart, parallel, and then take the arms out to the side, extending those fingers out to the sides and draw the tummy up, allow the tailbone to drop down, breathe in, here we go, clockwise. And go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Start hands on the hips, breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. Again, breathe in and out. Okay, second right, come and sit down. You're gonna be doing leg raises in effect. If you need to support your back, you can work with bent legs until you feel that the back is strong enough to support you. In other words, you'll be inhaling like this, lifting the head up and the knees as the feet come off the ground and exhale down. Otherwise, your legs are straight and you inhale, legs up 90 degrees, head up and exhale down. Again, just do as many as you feel you can and make up later. Let's take a complete breath before we begin. Inhale to exhale. Inhale, one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and relax. Roll over to your side. Use your hands to support you up to stand and two breaths. Hands on the hips, inhale. Exhale through the mouth. Again, inhale. And exhale. Okay, the next practice is on your knees. Knees hip width apart, hands underneath your buttocks. You're going to inhale and push the pelvis forward, let the head roll back, and then exhale, bring it back upright, drop the head forward. Okay, 21 times. Let's take a breath together before we start. Breathe in and breathe out through the nose. Okay, inhale, one. Exhale, two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, 
nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay, great. So, next one on your bottom. Placing the feet flat on the floor, knees upright, your hands are behind you. You're going to make what's perhaps known um, as a reverse tabletop. So, in other words, you're inhaling and lifting the pelvis so that it becomes level with the knees and the shoulders. Okay, and then exhaling down. Okay, if that's too much on your wrists, um, and personally I'll be working like this with my fists on the floor. Okay, so that there's not too much pressure on those wrists. So we're going to practice up to 21. Again, just do as many as you can. <clears throat> Let's take a breath together before we start breathing. And out through the nose. Inhale, one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay, come up, take a couple of breaths. last one. Many of you all know the upward dog or the downward dog through yoga. So it's moving between those two. And again, if it's too much for the hands on the floor, you can work with the fists. I'm going to work with my hands because I don't find that so troublesome. So <clears throat> knees directly below the hips, toes tucked under, ready to go up. Let's just establish the downward dog position first. So exhale, push up, and you're wanting to bring that chest as close to the knees as possible and taking that bottom as high as possible. And then you're going to inhale into an upward dog. When you inhale, think about tucking your tailbone under so that you try and maintain as much length in that lower spine as possible and the head looks forward. So let's have a go. You're exhaling up to dog, inhaling down. So from your upper dog here, we are going to exhale down the dog. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19, 
20, 21, down onto your knees, come up to standing, hands on the hips, breathe in and out. One more, breathe in and breathe out. And that's it.